Hi, this is, perhaps, Tim Walters. I'll be speaking at Group Futurista's Future of Data Protection Summit in Berlin on November 8th and 9th. Given the subject of my presentation, namely the GDPR in the age of surveillance capitalism, I thought it would be appropriate to use some of the tools and methods of surveillance capitalism for this brief promo. So rather than a talking head, you get these seemingly random fragments of information about me. Places I've been, sites I visit, where I shop, what I do, where I've worked, people I've admired and loved. Glimpses into my interest, my passions, my obsessions, and, perhaps, exposure of secrets so dark I don't even know them myself. Surveillance capitalism maintains that the accumulation aggregation and analysis of all of this data about me can begin to deliver a profile or a picture not only of what I, who and what I am and not only as well of what I will do or desire in the future but, and this is both the promise and the peril of surveillance capitalism, this data simulacrum is supposed to give its owner the power to influence and perhaps even to determine my future behavior, choices, allegiances, and thoughts. When we talk about the GDPR in the age of surveillance capitalism, the core question is, will the GDPR be the immovable object that reigns in the excesses of surveillance capitalism, curbs its insatiable appetite for personal data, and introduces an era of responsible, ethical, and mutually beneficial data processing? Or, Rather, will surveillance capitalism prove to be an irresistible force for which the GDPR will ultimately be of no more significance than a twig in a raging river? Please join me, or someone very much like me, in Berlin on November 8th and 9th, 2018.